tonight. A dispute in a local neighborhood. Who wants to live in a neighborhood you got to drive past this every day? It's it's disgusting. Well, rats, snakes, and the smell of trash. That's what some neighbors in Laverne say they are dealing with every day. And according to those neighbors, a lot with an abandoned trailer is to blame. Residents in the area of Waldron Road tell Stephanie Langston they've reached out to city officials with no resolve. Well, neighbors here tell me they are fed up saying the property here on JFK Drive has looked like this for years with overgrown grass, piles of trash, and rodents running rampant. It's awful. It's awful. Ask anyone on the street and the feeling is mutual. It's yeah, disgusting. It it's disgusting. Calling the site an eyesore with tarps covering piles of boxes on the front porch as well as trash around the overgrown property. It literally looks like a meth den with all of the tarps and everything like it looks like a safety hazard. It looks like an episode of hoarders when they leave. It's a hoarders episode. So everything's stacked up on the porch because they have so much stuff inside. It's stacked up outside. The trash is stacked up outside. So you know what they do? They cover it up with tarps and they cover it up with sheets. A pungent smell permeating from the lot through the neighborhood, they say, especially on a humid day. Oh, you can smell it. It's mm -hmm. awful. It's awful. Yes, it's awful. There's probably dead animals under those piles of trash. But they say there are plenty of living animals as well, and they've made their way from the abandoned lot into their homes. It's causing rodents, snakes, bugs, uh, and then it's infesting the whole neighborhood. It's like it's breeding a new type of animal. It's really, yeah, it's very unsettling. Causing concerns, especially for children and pets like gopher rats, the size yeah, rat, of possums, rats, mice. They come up through my vent. It's an issue city officials say they were made aware of nearly five years ago, with codes enforcers visiting the property more than 24 times since. I think everybody on the street has complained to codes. A danger sign posted on the fence deeming the property abandoned and uninhabitable. Neighbors, on the other hand, pleading for the city to help. I want to go on somebody to tear it down, clean it out. So I don't even care if it's vacant lot, just as long as they get rid of it. In Laverne, Stephanie Langston, News 2. Well, city officials admitted to Stephanie the process has been slower to work through than they would have liked, saying that they are currently going through processes for slum clearance. We have more details about that on our website, WKRN.com.